This man turned to News 4 after he couldn't get a refund from the city that they owed him. And once you know, just hours after we stepped in, he gets a call. Chief Investigator Lauren Traeger has that story. Oh, no, I got a ticket. Then I noticed the sign. I said, oh, today is Thursday, the last one of the month. Thelonious Lee says he didn't realize it was street cleaning day until he found a parking ticket on his van's windshield back in July last year. And the next day I was at the post office and found a money order, filled them out, and sent out because I was raising talk. You got bills, pay them as soon as you can. But he soon discovered he had overpaid, accidentally sending a $73 money order that was intended for another bill, not the $15 one for the parking ticket. A month later, I called him. It's coming. Two months after that, I called him. It's coming. He says while they promised to issue a refund, he never got it. If I'm a taxpayer and that's money you owe me, you should pay me my money. Ticket fines, he notes, double and triple if you don't pay, but it seemed there was no time frame for his reimbursement. And so you called him right away? Right away. And here we are, still nothing? Still nothing. So it got to the point I'm tired of calling. So I called uh, Channel 4. Called you, Lauren Drago. Maybe then uh, something happened. And sure enough, one quick email from us to the St. Louis Treasurer's Office. Park and Buell called me and said, oh, we saw you can come pick up your money. And in just 24 hours, Lee had his check in hand. I'm happy to get it, you know. Now I can uh, pay down on a bill. But it, it shouldn't have took this. It shouldn't have took this. The Treasurer's Office says he didn't initially provide an accurate address, adding that refunds are processed within two weeks of the end of the month's bookkeeping. Still, Lee says he couldn't get a straight answer on his own and hopes others aren't facing the same ticket trouble. Now it's done, but I hope other people get, it, get their money back too. Certainly happy he got some resolution. Now, is there an issue you want us to look into for you? Email us at investigates at KMOV.com. I'm Lauren Traeger, News 4 Investigates. Today marks 